Every time we get together is special, uh, but today we have something extra special. I want to share with all of you and present to all of you the elders of Venia Church. Uh, we brought them out today to uh, make sure you guys know their faces and um, anoint them with oil. So Pastor Taylor's going to anoint the elders, but Pastor Scott's been working for the last year and a half plus uh, with each of these elders, and so he's going to share a little bit about that process with you. All right. So um, about a year and a half or so ago, we looked at the men of the church that had uh, shown themselves to be men of good character. And um, let me just stop right there. With Behind every good man is a better woman, woman, right? So this is the elders of the church and their wives. And so uh, we looked at the men of the church who had been serving, serving faithfully, and we could attest to their character. And so we said that uh, we begin a time with them and um, uh, pour into them and uh, teach them and uh, just give them some experience. And so they've already been involved in some premarital counseling with some of you. Uh, they've been doing some counseling in general. They serve at the church. But uh, we were looking for men of good character, good reputation, that knew that they managed their households well. And so God showed us these guys. Good choice? I think it's a good choice. Amen? Yes. But with that now is... Uh, They've accepted this role of elders of the church. They are here to serve you. They are servants of the church. They were, these are the biggest servants of the church that, that are ever were supposed to be. They're here to love on you, to help you meet, meet your needs, to pray for you, to give your counsel, give your wisdom. Whatever that you need, is. these are the couples that you can come to and help you out in your walk while you're here at Venia Church. And so they've stepped up to that level. They've said that uh, God's called them to this. And so I would encourage you guys to be praying for them. Uh, the target on their back is bigger than ever before. And so this is the elders of your church. All right. So uh, because with this new responsibility and challenge in their life, definitely, as Pastor, Con Pastor Scott said, is an increase of spiritual warfare. And so if you guys would just extend your hands out as a sign of blessing and agreeance, and we're going to just pray over these families. Father, we come before you today as a family, as a church body, as um, a congregation that loves you. And Lord, we see uh, your spirit moving in the lives of of these men and women. Lord, we see that you have developed in them a love for you, developed in them a love for your people, and as they've stepped up to answer the call on their life that you've placed on them to be elders, to, to love the people, to care for the people, to, uh, to give counsel and wisdom and to be a good example, Lord, we know that in that, the enemy Lord, especially today in the message, just knowing there's an enemy that's out to destroy us, that wants to ruin our reputation, ruin our witness for you. I pray that you would give each of them strength and courage and, Lord, uh, perseverance to be the men and women you've called them to be. Bless their marriage, bless their family, bless all that they do. We pray for this together as family. We pray for it in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 God bless you guys. Thank you so much.